Do What You Can't by Casey Neistat is one of the most inspiring videos I have ever seen on YouTube because it talks directly to the creator, directly to the person behind the camera, directly to me. The message is clear, simple, concise, and to the point. Today, you can do what you couldn't do previously. We have access to technology, cameras, tools, and the platform to share it in an unprecedented Hello, manner. And your willingness to create is the only thing holding you back. No, you can't be an astronaut, but you can build a two-stage rocket in your backyard, drive out to the Black Rock Desert, strap a GoPro to it, and send it 260,000 feet over the Earth. No, you can't do comedy anymore on account of everything being shut down because of COVID. But what you can do is grab a couple friends with cameras, stuff a microphone into a guitar amp, fire off a few texts, and do a set on a rooftop in New York City. No, Johnson, you can't hire override films to chase you down a dry lake bed while you fly your paramotor and pretend you're making a car commercial. But he can dream up the idea. So I reached out on Instagram and said, here's my idea, how can you help? Then, somebody sent me a pin to a place 42 miles from the nearest gas station in the middle of nowhere. So I stuffed my paramotor in the van and drove the three hours there. A dude I've never met before said, I'll chase you with my drone, see you tonight. Okay, now we got something. I wanted two paramotors in the shot, so I reached out to my wingman, Trevor Steele, and said, What are you doing this weekend? Probably a whole lot of nothing. No, you are gonna co-star with me and maybe Dave in a paramotor car commercial. I'm in on it. Don't have an arm truck? Well, we can ratchet strap the back door of the van open, mount my camera to this $300 gimbal I bought on Amazon, and Dave can hang out the back. And you know what? I think that dust on the lens looks good in the sunlight. And we get the shot again and again and again and again. And halfway through it, realize you made a new friend because my god, Chet, you're killing it with the drone! And unintendedly, in the process, you reignite a fire that you thought was dying inside of you. I've been missing this. I've been missing moments in my life where the thing I'm doing, the place I'm at, has me like so excited, I get overwhelmed. I don't know what to do with myself. You remember why you moved 3,000 miles west to chase this dream of paramotoring and filmmaking in the first place. Imagine the shot. 40 miles an hour, two paramotors just like right next to each other. Mock Jesus, just yeah! You become awestruck with nature again like it was the first time. Realize you've stumbled upon a paramotoring wonderland. What you did is have a really good weekend. You got out in nature, you went flying, you met some new friends, you filmed some cool stuff, and at the end of all of it came to realize that Casey was right. The internet is a place without boundaries, and the only thing holding you back is your willingness to create. And this week I decided to create a paramotor car commercial. Out of nothing comes nothing. You can't, in other words, get something out of nothing. And it's occurred to me that this is a fallacy of tremendous proportions that lies at the root of all our common sense, not only in the West, but in many parts of the East as well.